Hello everyone, I am IA Roadkill and we are playing Farming Simulator 19. We are homesteading Grizzly Mountain with hard economy and no loans. We are playing on the PlayStation 4 and this is episode 49. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons please. Thank you. We are on a tree cleansing mission. I am removing all of these junk trees. I call them junk trees because they're a pain to try and harvest. I used to harvest them before the treks came out. They are just not worth it anymore. Whoa, too far. Plus they have ghost limbs and yeah. If they can fight you, they do. So I am removing all of the junk trees and what few small trees I run across, the little baby trees, and remove those before we get to harvesting this side of the the river. I'm not going to worry about anything over there yet. I'm just worrying about this side for now. Oh, there's a little one right there. Oh, too far. There we go. This is going to open it up a lot. I really don't have that many of the pine trees here. Yeah, there's a handful, but there isn't really a dense foresty area on this side. It says there is right here in front of me. Yeah, I guess so. It's a little bit dense. Not like the other side that I started with, though. So yeah, I'm kind of excited to put some big fields over here, I think. I was thinking about putting a road right alongside the river here. An alternate way to get to the store and the lumber mill. since there's a gate right there. Two little baby trees lined right up for me. That tree right there isn't really too worth harvesting but we will just because it'll be easy I don't 
think there's one of these trees in the center of that mess anywhere. I don't see it anyway. I think I'm going to leave the one tree right in the center of the road there. Right there. I'm going to leave him. Oh, there's one right there, dead ahead. Now I'm thinking they're all gone. Great demand at the barn, great demand at the ranch. Well, I don't know what the difference is. What's the difference between the barn and the ranch? The barn is where you sell wheat and silage and stuff. The ranch is, oh, milk. Well, I don't have any cows. No. That wasn't blue. There's blue. Sunflowers. You sell sunflowers at the ranch. Okay. So the ranch is the tipper area. Okay. <gasps> I have grass ready to harvest. We best be getting back. Stay on top of that. Every time it turns the burnt orange, hit it again. Plus, I think I'm already done with all those trees. Oop, there's a baby tree right there. Oop. Guess I could have looked for those as well. Ooh. That one left a stump. There we go. So yeah, it's pretty open over here. I take down a few trees and it'll be ready to plow pretty darn quick. Oop, there's another one. Get these out of the way now because they're in the way. They're a big hassle when I'm trying to harvest trees. I run into them because I don't see them. And I think that's it. Alright. Turn that down. And I'll probably just park this right here. It's off the road. Hmm, I wonder if my harvester's going to be in the way over there. I'm not sure. Don't know quite how to deal with that big rock over there either. That's what I was staring at. Oh, 
Um, yeah, let's start over here. I may have to move that beehive. That kind of bothers me that it's in the way. And I noticed that the map is broken. Notice the filters over there for growth do not show up. Fruit types are there, but soil composition is gone and growth is gone. Now, I believe that happened after I downloaded a map that had some new crops on it. I can't say that for certain, but I think that's when that problem showed up. All right, buddy, why are you stopping there? It was like he was seeing the corner of the uh, fence for the orchard. Well, let's see if I can do this. No, we're done. Look how clear it looks over there already. set the worker loose over here and then I will hop back on the tree harvester there we go he'll do that and I will come over here and find the tree harvester and get to work um, on the new property over there
Okay, do I have enough down? I think so. Yeah, we'll take down these three right here. And there's a little tree that was hiding from me. But we've found him now. We'll take care of him. We'll go to the rock here. Okay. I think I'm going to grind stumps next. So I need to grind a stump at every pile of logs. I think I kind of liked that. I know that there are no stumps over there now. And now I need to go find the big wheel. I need to take a break from trees. I think I will roll up some grass. And there we go. More endorphins. What a muddy mess. Oh, 
Boy, that turns fast when it's on the front. There we go. And I'm going to stall just a little bit longer. Oh. Uh, but I seem to have lost my semi truck. Oh, there it is. It's in front of the cedar. going to grab some of these pink marshmallows and fill the trailer up. Well, shucky darn, I don't know why I thought I had this bailed already. Two more. How about that one and that one? And 186, 213. Yeah, might as well get rid of them. strap down in their own peculiar way that way they're ready to come off the trailer when I get there speaking of which I need to paint a road over here whoa don't you dare don't 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 no 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 Oh, I forgot when they're strapped down, it's wobbly. When it's in the loading mode or transport mode, it's like they're not even on the trailer. That was close. So let us Yeah, I think straight off of that. Start landscaping and we will paint.
about that size. I believe that's dirt. Let's put it on round. Too bad I can't drive while I'm doing this. too straight there. Oh, but I can't paint green back on. I can paint green, I just can't paint grass. And let's see, let's turn around. And we'll do... Come on, get off the truck. Well, I'm going to have to move the truck before I can fix that. But that's not too bad. If I do say so myself. Oh, I guess I got to have them unstrapped. No, it sold some of them. I got 44,000 somehow about there. Eh, I'm going to leave it. Looks nice and rough that way. Yeah. That looks pretty good. Every time I look over here, I think I haven't seen any deposits from my apples. I don't know if I just keep missing it or... Oh, almost. There we go. Yeah, I... I'm never watching the clock right at on the hour.
And it did it to me again. Alright, we are done with that field. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Did a slide on the corner there. Alright, I need to go pick up those bales, and then I can get back to work on some logs. Okay, that is way squirrely to drive from the cab. Yeah, I don't think I'll be doing that for a while. Okay, here we go. Load some logs. Uh, I think I forgot to grind stumps over here. Those two aren't lined up. Oh yeah, they are. I remember them now because I was thinking about pushing these two up to the other two and I thought, nah, I can just do it with the big wheel. Really? There should be a fix for that. And that time they just slide right out. Makes no sense. I'm not yelling at modders. That one's precarious. I wonder if we can get it there. Not if we keep jumping over stuff.
We made it! Yay! Anything else over here? Nope. Darn it, I was trying to get that little one. Look at that, they're all stacked up in a straight line. Ready to pop. Really? Another small one. Well, at this rate, I'll have three small ones to make a load. Got the small one that time. I know I'm jinxing myself. Something's going to fall out. Before I lose these two, we best go pick them up. Well... There's one. Dragon. There we go. Sure, just give it a shove. Well, this way I can regroup. There we go. Beautiful. That cracking sound reminds me my computer is going in for a diagnostic and I hope I get it back working. It has a problem right now. Uh, it is like the mouse has a mind of its own it uh, jumps around the screen, clicks on stuff, opens things, closes things, resizes things. Uh, generally causes uh, chaos from time to time. And they think it is a cracked motherboard. I'm hoping it's an easy fix. But we will have to see what happens. Hopefully, videos will not be interrupted too much. I'm hoping to have a couple backed up to release for two days, maybe three, and we'll go from there. I've never tried to use Share Factory. I may have to try. But anyway, thought I'd better let you know. And that's going to happen Monday morning. Did you notice the change when we came around the corner? I forgot to tell you. Our money was at 144,000 ish. And now it's at 139, so I've spent $10,000. But what did I spend it on, you say? Well, let me tell you. In a minute. We have to unload this first. But I wanted to point out the money situation before it changed. So, 
No, I want to jump out. I don't want to unhook. And we have plenty of money to do a silo now. All right. Come on, get up there. Get up there so I can turn. There we go. Okay, here we go. What is different about the corner? Oh, tree's still there. That didn't cost me anything. Still got grass. I can see the apple orchards. I can see the beehive. I don't see what changed. What about the lineup of the beehive? I pushed it over and it cost me $10,000 to do it. So next time we have to mow grass, beehive will not be in the way. I was kind of proud of that. I remembered to do it. Okie doke. Well, I'm going to make this be the end of the episode. We'll have to finish up the log pickup, and I guess I'm just going to call it a uh, farm layout because I'm second guessing myself. I was thinking about putting the silo down here at the end of this small field. I'm thinking about just leaving that field alone now and maybe putting the silo over here at the end of this field or where there would be a field or maybe on the corner here or maybe move the lime silo and put the grain silo here I don't know I just don't know so think about it if you come up with any ideas let me know I won't do anything like I said, I'm going to have my computer in, so I won't do anything for a while on that. I'm going to... I'm trying to figure out where I need to park. I'm going to just do some farming and tree chopping so that I don't miss out on a good comment. And I'm drawing a blank. There we go. So yeah. I would like to thank everyone who stayed to watch the entire video. If you found it enjoyable, I would appreciate it if you would hit that like button. If you'd like to see more, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. That would really help me out. And if you'd like to leave a comment, you may do so below. With that said, I would like to wish everyone, including you, a very wonderful day. Goodbye for now.